Team keep it clean. I need my uh, Ravens fans detectives for this one. Um, because the Baltimore Ravens, they have opened up a roster spot. Um, because they waived Isaiah Mack. They waived him, released him, cut him, whatever you want to call it. He's not on the team anymore. Um, so he, he had just got signed to the 53-man roster uh, before that Falcons game. They put him on there. Uh, but now they've taken him off. So, two things. One... Uh, this is a good sign for Calais Campbell that he could be ready, he could be back, he, he could be making his return uh, this week against the Steelers in what is still an important game because while the Ravens are in the playoffs, they could still be fighting for the division. And if they win the last two games, they win a the division. Um, but anyway, so that could, that's a good sign for him that he's back. Um, but we won't know till really tomorrow, so we'll see. But with them opening up a roster spot, Calais Campbell's already on the roster. He wasn't taken off the roster. Um, you would think that, like, the Ravens don't make moves like this for nothing. They don't waive people just for no reason. They don't waive people just to waive them. Uh, they waive them in order to make a corresponding move, especially when the roster goes from 53, like it was before he got waived, to 52. Because uh, they're not just giving a shout-out to Ray Lewis. Um, they are going to make a move. So are they going to add somebody? I know my guy, I was just talking to my guy Joshua a little bit ago, and he's thinking, well, maybe they could be adding Anthony Brown to the active roster, the quarterback, because that was his third call up. So they have to either add him to the active roster, or they have to release him, and he had to clear he had to clear through waivers. Then they can sign him to the practice squad again. Now, if they add Anthony Brown to the active roster, that wouldn't give me the best feeling about Lamar Jackson's status, but it could that could be the move. That could be the one. Because, again, like, you don't want to – they're in a tricky spot because you, you don't want to risk losing Anthony Brown just in case Lamar isn't ready. And then you, you subject your backup quarterback to waivers, um, and then he gets claimed by somebody. Somebody like, oh, Anthony Brown, I like him. Give me him. So you, you don't want to risk that. Um, but – then at the same time, yeah, that would kind of make you think like, oh, maybe Lamar's won't be ready to go this week. And may, it could kind of make you think the injury may be a little worse than we thought. Who knows? I don't know. But um, I'm just wondering, like, what other moves? Could somebody be returning from injured reserve? Because they said, the, I mean, the only people who could be returning may be Tylen Wallace. Um, would, they, would they bring him back from IR, though? I don't know. Oh, Kevon Seymour. He has an injury. Um, and I don't know how long he's going to be out for. Uh, Harbaugh spoke really, really briefly about it yesterday because somebody asked him. So could they be bringing in a corner? I, I don't know, man. I really don't know. Uh, it's I'm lost on this one. That's why I said I need all my team keep it clean and Ravens, detectives and whatnot. I need y'all to help us figure this one out.